Good morning. Today we're going to do a speed sensor on a 2001 883. What it is doing is the speedometer is not working. It will state the miles, but the miles don't move. The speedometer doesn't work. My first assessment would be switch out the speed sensor. Buy it at Harley Davidson. This is pretty much what it looks like. You have your wire clip here. What we will do is disconnect it. At the now what we want to do is remove the seat. You have your little Phillips head back here. Slide aside. This is the plug for your speed sensor. So what we need to do is Now take a picture at the way these wires are located and their colors. All right, now let's work it apart. This is the piece that's being removed. Okay, now that we took pictures of that, let's go to the other side. Now, right here above the transmission, you're gonna see a small, I believe it's 3 16 we need to remove that to remove the sensor. This is where it gets a little tricky. What I did was connect a pair of vice grips to the 3 16 Allen head. And now I'm getting it from over here. You gotta be patient. It'll take you a little bit to get it in there. What I did was I grinded a little of this edge off so it could slip in there a little easier, which it is not easy. But once you get it and you alter that Allen head a little. Okay, we got it. Now you need leverage to get this to turn. Counterclockwise, all you want to do is crack it. Oh, we got it. All right, you see that? Let's take this off. Remove that, that's the start of this. What I'm gonna do is put a little blue tape here so we don't scratch nothing. Arbor Freight, it's a swivel. It's a great tool to have. Now, try to get in there. There we go. Now that's why I got that blue tape there. And there we go. I make it look easy, you gotta remember, I can edit my video. Now we see it moving. We got the tape here so we don't scratch nothing. There we go. So difficult. You cannot do this without this swivel. If you could, let me know. Quarter turn out of time. This is the hardest part. Because you gotta be perfectly square onto it. Or you will strip it. Now I got this little magnet. go cannot you have to have that perfectly square to remove this what you want to do is rock it back and forth to break that seal oh, there we go beautiful now that you see it rotated be careful take a nice big screwdriver Okay, there's an O-ring that makes a seal. 
So if we can get in there. Well, it's coming. See what I'm doing? I'm coming through here by your front pulley sprocket. And you can see we got it. There we go. It's a $40 part. A lot of people say clean it. Removed. Now, as you see, this wire goes up here. Now, what I'd like to do, this is the end. And you can see. What I like to do is disconnect these wires, attach, and drag it through. A lot of people will get tempted to cut this and splice it back on, but you don't have to do that. You'll see there's a green, and be patient. Okay, that's what keeps everything honest. Put that aside. Now we gotta remove this orange pad. Okay, let's see what we're doing. If you look real close, you'll see there's a plastic clip. I got my hand on the black. That's one. Now I got my hand on the white. That's this corner right here. That's two. Now for the red one. Now we have this. Let's put this aside. This is so it keeps it waterproof. Remember how this goes. It's basically simple. If you want, take a picture. These phones come in really handy. I'm gonna put that aside. I'm gonna twist these up and attach this to a wire, pull it through, and then do it in reverse to install. All right, if you see, I'm just gonna tie a knot. Double it up, it's pretty strong. Okay, see how that is? Now I'm gonna pull it through the other side and then use this to install my other one. All right, as you see, this is where our string was. This is where our sensor is. Now, with caution, pull it through, and look what we got. So now, I do the same thing to the new one and install in reverse. So we know that this being here, black is gonna be right there. So the first thing we wanna do is reinstall the, the waterproofing. So 
So if we look at that, line them both up the same. So we know white is here. We know white is here, as you see there. We know black. one is red. Double check, this is important. Okay, now we got that. Black, white, red. Now we know this will go like that. So let's start off with the white. That wasn't bad. Now I'll go with the black. All you're doing is pushing it through and you'll hear a clip. And now we got the red at the bottom. Beautiful. This green clip, as we've seen before, look at that. And this keeps everything nice and honest. Beautiful. This is the new one. That's the old one. I'm gonna keep this not connected for now. Put this aside. Now we gotta take this one apart to run it to the string. What it is, this will not go. I wish it would. I've tried before. It doesn't. And if you don't do, I've seen people cut it. Just take your time. Any questions, just ask. These tools are cheap. Harbor Freight, eBay, wherever. our plug. Lay it down. Just as we did before, grab the red wire. And you'll see that little rubber snap right there. That's one. It's that simple. Now for the white one. It's two. goes three. Let's remove this gasket. Now she's all free. We're going to do the same thing. Wrap it up. Come around. Wrap it up. Two knots in it to be safe. Nice and clear. One more knot. One more knot. Supposed to be on the side of caution. A little electrical tape. We don't want this to get caught on anything. And that's what we got. A little tug, she seemed nice. All right, now pull that string. She going, there you go.
Don't get no easier. Now this is the next hard part, which ain't hard. It really isn't hard. By the tab. Like I said, the camera don't make it easy, but you don't gotta worry about the camera. There we go. Find it up. And you'll feel a clip right in place. Now this is a little tough. Now we gotta get that back in there. Little magnet. Start you off. Beautiful. Let's just get her started. It's gonna be a little quarter times. Like I said, without this swivel, it's not happening. So now we're gonna go on the other side and hook up the electrical. Don't use no razor blade. Cleanly take this apart and put it together. Be careful. Now remember, we have this one we did before. We'll mirror that. We can see the black. All right, that's black. Then we got white. Okay. This black, white, and the bottom is your red. All right, take your time. Okay, now with this, identical to that, we know we got black here. And you'll hear them click right in. It's easy, it really is easy. Okay, now you watch the white. I'm using this as my index point. All right, so we know we got white in this corner. You'll hear it. And now we know we got red in the bottom. Beautiful. Now remember, we got this green. That's why we put everything back together, just in case. Beautiful. Okay, 
and that's what keeps the plug nicey nice. Now we got this. This keeps the leather out. Push it in. Easy, easy. Match up these two points. You see the way this is? And you'll hear it. Beautiful thing. Then you'll see this. That goes right on the frame. It can go here or go there. Turn your key on. Alright, let's put the choke on. I can see the miles is on, so that's a good sign. Alright, we see the miles. I'll take it for a ride and it all should work. Thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Ride safe and have a great day.